Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to what Leonardo it's in a day video one of my most favorite videos to film today I'm going to show you what my seven months old baby it's throughout a typical day and if you're new here welcome my name is Karina this is baby Leonardo I am a full-time mom I also have a daughter she is three years old and here on my channel I share my experience ideas tips and tricks to try and make motherhood and fatherhood a bit easier on you so if this sounds like something you'd like to watch make sure to subscribe hit the bell icon I post every single Thursday and sometimes I do a bonus video here and there so make sure to don't miss out on my new content going live and today we are gonna tell you what this guy ate for breakfast lunch and dinner and maybe a snack one or two but at this point of time when I'm filming this he already had breakfast and lunch so I'm going to walk you through what he ate so we start waking up very early because we have some big changes going on Michaela finally started preschool which is so exciting and I can talk about that a little bit more in a different video but because I have to wake up and uh, make her breakfast get her ready pack her lunch and all that he wakes up with me and that's around six o'clock in the morning which he wakes up around this time anyways um, it's just if I don't stay there with him nursing him through the morning he won't sleep so he wakes up with us and uh, he's hungry obviously so <laughs> while I make uh, everybody's breakfast uh, I need to sit him in the high chair and give him some food already and something quick I usually give him are these green pea crisps from Aldi he is not very much into them but uh, they entertain him also this morning I gave him a little bit of uh, a string cheese I cut it in little pieces so he can um, you know play with it and master his pincer grasp and he likes to eat this cheese too uh, so he was busy with that and he became unhappy again and I gave him an egg white half of egg white also just um, chopped it up and he was uh, playing and eating then I was making him his usual oatmeal which he's not as much into anymore because he gets full from other foods I give him in the morning and he loves to eat with his hands now um, but lately I've been adding berries to his oatmeal and that adds a lot of fiber in his diet uh, and uh, also I add a little bit of butter and then uh, when everybody is ready I feed him oatmeal and usually I don't uh, give him a spoon in the morning so that I don't have as much of a mess to clean up after everything so I feed him a little bit and usually uh, lately he's not eating as much of oatmeal anymore because he has all this other stuff to eat he probably ate a quarter of egg white uh, a little bit of cheese and half a portion of his oatmeal he seemed very full and happy and then he went for a nap and so after his little nap he woke up hungry and that was just like about 11 in the morning while I was preparing his lunch he was screaming so I had to give him something I had laying around which was a piece of bread uh, so he played with that a little bit uh, then um, the food was still not ready he ended up eating some of his breakfast leftovers and this is what I'm giving him for lunch today he's having some of brown rice and quinoa pasta he loves this lately especially this kind so that he can grab it easily and I'm giving him a little bit of roasted cauliflower I warm it up in this pasta water just like that and I still feed him uh, the parades I made the other days as a week uh, I'm almost out of them because his appetite increased so much lately and he's not so much into those parades anymore it seems like I will never make parades again for him because um, now he is on the table food full-on or maybe I can just you know smash something with a fork uh, so today he's having uh, chicken sweet potato quinoa and apple puree and he didn't seem very interested in it although in the end he ended up eating it all 
he also ate pretty much all the pasta I put on his plate and he ate almost all the cauliflower. For lunch I usually try to give him his spoon and let him go to town and practice all his skills with feeding himself with a spoon and stuff. Uh, so this is the uh, one time in the day when I, uh, you know, make myself um, give him full freedom and uh, deal with the mess. This is when I'm willing to deal with the mess. And the best part about him loving this food so much is that it entertains him. Lately he became more needy and he needs more of one-on-one -on -one quality, undivided attention. So this is also the way to keep him happy, keep him in his high chair with some snacks, food. And also, you know, it's a great opportunity to master that pincer grasp. It's a very important thing to learn for them. And he's loving practicing it. And this is all he ate so far today. It's about 12.30 p.m. and he's going for his second nap soon. And we'll see what he'll request after that. Probably some snack. So I'll update you then. It's after 3 p.m. and we're back to update you on what he's eating. He's having after nap time snack. And right now I gave him some more cheese. Just like this. This is just string cheese from Aldi, organic string cheese. And I'm planning to give him a few of these freeze-dried fruit. <laughs> yeah, it's, I'm about to give you, hold on. And these freeze-dried apples. So let's see. <laughs> yeah, he loves this. Yeah, if you've been around here for a while, you know that I swear by the freeze-dried fruits. Uh, they are amazing for babies this age. They dissolve in their mouths quickly and um, it's just one ingredient, apples. And this one is actually new. Uh, it's a blend of banana and strawberry. Bananas are cut in rounds, so I'm breaking them in half for him. He's not very happy about these, not very um, in love, but the apples are a hit. <laughs> yeah? Okay, let's give you some. Okay, he doesn't seem very satisfied with what I gave him, so I'm giving him some pasta from lunch. Maybe he'll eat this, and I have some more cauliflower. I'm gonna give him just like this, <laughs> so he can hold it. Yeah, you like pasta? Нравится макароны? Mmm, that's better, right? That's better. What happened? You were not that hungry? Were you? No. Didn't eat much. It didn't entertain him for too long either? Okay, we'll take you out, okay? What? What are you saying? You're done? All done? All done? Все? Ну пошли. It's after 5 p.m. Everybody's home and somebody is ready for his dinner already. Our dinner is not quite ready just yet, but usually we try to eat together. But now I'm gonna feed him separately today. Yes, because he's upset. And he wants his food, so he's having one of those parades that I froze. And this is beef and butternut squash with some quinoa and apple. This is his favorite pretty much. And 
Yes, mom, mom, mom. I'm gonna add a drop of his vitamin D to it. Okay, let's eat up. Let's eat up. Let's do it. Okay, it seems like he's done. He ate about half of this jar and he is interested in all of his leftovers. Yes, you're a very talkative guy. Yes, so I wanted to make sure I'll tell you that he obviously breastfeeds throughout the day and currently, today for example, he, breast he breastfed three times during the day. So he's gonna go to sleep. I'm so sorry. He's gonna go to sleep very soon, maybe at like <laughs> seven. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Anyways, if you like this video, if it uh, gave you any value, if you got some meal and snack ideas out of it, make sure to give it a like, subscribe, hit the bell icon, and we want to wish you to have happy and healthy babies. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next week. Bye. Okay, I'll take you out now. Okay, okay.